Hello, beautiful, blessed beings of love and light. Natasha Monique here, founder of the Awakening Sacred Alchemy Program, and welcome to your April 28th to May 4th water sign reading. This reading is for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces for the week of April 28th to May 4th. I'm using Ostar Tarot and Work Your Light Oracle. We pull in five cards, mind, body, soul, spirit, and then an oracle card for our messages from the universe. I encourage you to watch your sun, moon, and rising so you get a full, full understanding of what's going on for you for this week. For a limited time, I will be offering emailed readings. You can ask a question. It's a five-card reading. You can ask a question, have a topic, or it can be a general reading. Be forty dollars. You can email me at tarot.tosh.balance at gmail.com, and upon payment, um, I will email you your reading within forty-eight hours of your payment. And yay, you have that to refer back to. I, of course, am still offering the live year-round and personal readings, and there are still spots open in the Awakening Sacred Alchemy program. So, for information on any of that, any of those services, please email me at tarot.tosh.balance at gmail.com. So let's get into this week's reading, Water Signs. Let's see what messages we have for you, Water Signs. So your message from the universe, all right, from our oracle card is boundaries. Where do you need to establish better boundaries? This is in your personal life, establishing these boundaries. Telling people no. Say no. You're going to have to say no. And you're going to have to let family members know what's cool and what's not cool. Because you have some family members that are just getting a little bit too much in your business, too much in your stuff. All right, and you got to let them know, like, hey, no, this isn't cool. Like, this is not your place to go here with it. All right, now, that is going to be your, your only, like, challenge that I see coming up for you this week is in setting boundaries. For the, that's, that's it. Everything for the other aspects of yourself throughout this week, it's, it's like, adventurous. It's going to be a pretty adventurous week. So do just know that someone you're going to have to say, hey, you're stepping on my toes. That's that's beyond your pay grade, so to speak. All right, it's above your pay grade. You don't you don't get to do that. So you've got the six of cups in your thoughts, the mind's position. So that is keeping your thoughts clean and young and fresh. Maybe remembering like the happiest moments of your life, sometimes during in childhood, sharing those things with other people, sharing them with the next generation, teaching the next generation how to play without an electronic device in their face, like what actual playing is, going back to that and spreading that to your next generation and just embodying that bit of fun. All right, so have a little bit of fun, some nostalgic fun. That's what your, your thought processes should be on getting your vibration to that that of balance and wholeness and reverence and joy. We've got for your actions, the Ten of Cups, all right? That's a, a another just a strengthening this. Like your, your mind, think it, do it. So now you're going to be doing it in bliss and abundance. Like this is going to bring you so much joy to play again, to remember to play. To go out there and try it. Try new things. Play with the kids in your family. Uh, even if you don't, like, even if you don't, like, have any children that you've birthed or the children that you've birthed are older, you've got to have some nieces, nephews, cousins, siblings, whatever, neighbors, your friends' kids. Like, just have that family time and know that that family time is abundance. That is wealth. Find the wealth in that, that, togetherness with your loved ones 
for your emotions We've got the Four of Wands in your emotions. Again, family, warmth, connectivity, being really secure and solid in your emotional well-being. Knowing that abundance is love as well, like that's what it is. Money is love, abundance is love. As long as you are in that embodiment of love, you are strong, you have a strong foundation, you are passionate, together, balanced, focused. But that Four and the Six two cards of balance here. So make sure you are balancing and giving yourself time to balance. All right, that's another boundary you have to set that no, it's me time. That's saying that to your family. I love you. I want to chill and party with y'all and cuddle with you and I want to play with you because that brings me joy too. But sometimes I need to just sit and chill and take a bath and relax on my own or get a massage or something like that. That's another boundary to set for yourself for this week. And then the messages from your higher self, we have the fool. Yes, go out there and take that leap. Your higher self is telling you, go for it. Go for it, go for it, go for it, do it. Chase the star, all right, chase the sun. Fly right up there to it. Now make sure that you are not being foolhardy, all right, but you are just being adventurous, all right, not being really foolish but being more playful, adventurous, and jovial. Okay, water signs, you're gonna be very balanced, happy, free-flowing this week, but make sure you set your boundaries. And don't let the setting of the boundaries fuck up all the rest of the, these emotions. That's, that's that, don't get too close to it, don't be foolish with things. All right. Don't be foolish. Being foolish would be that I had to set boundaries with Pam and now Pam's pissed at me. So now mm, I'm going to be pissed. Okay. No, that's Pam's problem. You go ahead and continue to have your adventurous excitement, joy, love, and abundance throughout this week, knowing that setting that boundary is the right thing for you to do. That also does feed that aspect of yourself that needs that feeding, that ability to go with what's going on in the world and in the universe and balancing yourself out with it. So I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope it did resonate with you. Please leave me comments below. Let me know. And please do like, subscribe, and share. Peace, love, and blessings, all of you beautiful beings. I will see you soon. Mwah.